So this year we, we've had some different things happen that have been interesting, fun, and in a sense sad. My father, uh, Phil, went home to be with Jesus this year at the end of August, and uh, he was really struggling. And we're thankful to see him with the Lord and able to, to be free again. But that's a sad time. He, uh, he led the way here in Zimbabwe along with my mother, and my, f my family was here when we were younger. And uh, really, Zimbabwe and uh, Karanda was an important part of his, his life. In fact, that Awana shelter we were talking about, or you'll hear about, uh, is a project in honor of, of my dad and his interest at Karanda of both children and the Awana clubs as well as the hospital. Another thing we did this year that was interesting was we had the birth just three days after my father's passing of our grandchild. Kathy, can you tell us about little Henry? Okay. So I went to the United States on our term break to help Heidi out for a month. Ruthie had already been there helping her out because she's had a hard pregnancy. So I enjoyed um, getting reacquainted with our two granddaughters and our son-in-law and family and seeing where Ruthie had relocated um, and then being there for the birth of the baby and exiting on an interesting note which, with the hurricanes. <clears throat> I think we got the last plane out. They closed the airport three hours after I left uh, Florida. So our little grandbaby's name is Henry Douglas the fourth. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs>